Good morning. It's Friday, people. And man, was it chilly this morning. Yep, I got a little bit of a walk-in. I don't think I was quite prepared for it. I went back and grabbed my fleece shirt. So I'm right along the river, so it gets even chillier there. The mist and the fog kind of settle right there. So, But it was brisk and clear and, yeah. Loving it. I hope you all get a chance to go out there. It's supposed to be 50s and 60s all weekend, so hopefully you have some fun stuff to do out there. Go pumpkin in. <laughs> so, um, it hasn't been too busy a week. It, we haven't got a whole lot of um, new stuff in. I did get a few things. So, we can, let's see. We got our table toppers in. So this is October. And I guess they wanted to clear the inventory shelves. So I got November's. And I got December's. So I know um, a few of you have been going through month to month doing them. So you can certainly come in and pick up your October topper sweet um what else do we have we me and patty have been having a few restless nights trying to get our head around the quilt shows coming up next week so we hope to see you all at merrimack valley show that should be a lot of fun for us um carol will be joining us there and we're going to be raffling off a Juki TL18. Um, you just need to do a little something that Carol's thought up. So um, come see us at the show and get entered into that raffle. It should be a lot of fun um, Friday and Saturday over there. I was busy last weekend. And I got... I don't know how much of this you're going to see, people, but let me get a crow in. Look at that crow in that pumpkin. Isn't he cool? So I'm going to get him hung up. Oh, maybe I won't. Maybe I'll take him to the quilt show. I was going to say, I'm going to get him hung up in the store. But maybe I'll take him to the quilt show. This is the pattern. I have a few of these in. It's really good size. I want to say it's about 40 inches. Um, yeah, I think it's like 40 inch, 44 inch square. So, um, you want to, you want to see that you can come in the store and I think I will probably bring it to the show with the patterns. Um, we need to get some fabric in. So here's one. You know who's going to like this, Shannon? Check this out. Look at those dinosaurs with their stocking hats on. I just thought this was so comical. I'll have you know, I did not order this. This was probably Carol. I don't remember seeing this at all. <laughs> but we got that in this week. We got another, um, we got a little um, 12 Days of Christmas book panel. And the girls were putting it together yesterday, but it's still kind of asunder out there. So I'll show you that next week. Um, we got this panel, which is really cool, used for pillows. Let's see if I can get some of those out. It's upside down, of course. So, this side says dream. The other side goes lengthwise, and it says create. And oh, you can't see it. Maybe there. Create. Yeah, you see it backwards. And there's some other little squares into that panel, which would be really cool. Um, my phone's moving. So, yeah, so a couple of bolts of um, fabrics we got in. Uh, let's see. Oh, and we got this neat little gadget. I love this thing. I brought one home. I'm going to stick it on my long arm. So... We're always fudging around trying to find our scissors, right? 
I put them down right here. They're over there. I put them down right here. They're over there. So, this little doodad has a sticky thing here. Not a magnet. Sticky. You stick it on the side of your machine, and this little hole holds your bigger scissors, and this little one holds your little scissors. Maybe you can see that picture. It's pretty cool. I got a few of these in. They're $14.99, but oh man. And of course, they're purple. <laughs> so come in and get one of those. I, I'm Like I said, I'm sticking it on my long arm for my little scissors because I'm always um, putting them down somewhere and then racing around trying to find them. So mine's going on my long arm. So let's see. Oh. So we have a usual list of classes coming up. This week, um, Saturday, Alice has an open sew from 2 to 4. So any of you looking to get some of those projects done, you might want to call up and sign up for that one or do it online. Sign up for that one and come in and join Alice and work on some of those projects. So the open sews is starting up again. Um, Kids class will be Sunday from 10.30 to 12.30 with Sue. I'm not sure. Um, I haven't looked at that class lately, but I know we've had um, interest in it before for the kids be, with it being held on the weekends when they're not doing school stuff. So um, again, that's the 25th. We have all day embroidery with Sue on September 26th, and that starts at 10 a.m. Um, Patty, oh, we scheduled a three, one of the one yard, three one yard quilt um, days you can do. Me and Patty have done a couple of the quilts to hanging. As you enter the store, they're hanging on the back side of the um, new fabric shelves, so you can check that out. But we have pretty much all the um, three yard quilt books. So that class is going to be on October 3rd and 17th. So it'll be two days. Um, and that's at 10.30 on October 3rd. Uh, oh, the pineapple. The Laura Heine pineapple class. I know Lori has, um, Lori will be teaching that. That's on the schedule. Um, it's generated quite a bit of interest. I believe there are a couple of spots left in it. Uh, that is October 13th or and or the 16th at 10.30. Um, and this guy. Hello. My little buddy. My little buddy for the day. So Alice did the snowman. He's so cute. We have to anchor this hat down. Maybe we can um, put some of those straight pins in it and hold his hat on. But he is freestanding snowflake snowman, and that will be held on October 25th. This would be a great gift for somebody. You want to do some of your embroidery, this would be awesome. And he does have um, a spot in the bottom, in the bottom, he's about a foot tall. There's a spot in the bottom for you to put one of those um, battery candles inside, which is cool. We have a few um, Juki classes coming up. So there is a there is one on October seventh, and. That is to make a textured applique wall ha hanging on the DX4000, I believe. And that is October 8th, at, uh, no, October 7th at 10.30 in the morning. Um, there are a few sign-ups on that one, so um, if you're interested in doing that, uh, Juki's Introduction to the Long Arm is on October 8th. We have one of them set up at the front of the store. Uh, 
and Juki, what's new with Juki? So she'll be going over, that's October 8th at one o'clock, and she'll be going over any of the new stuff that Juki's been coming out with. Those will be awesome. We had Alba from Juki in this past week. She did an in-house training with us so we could get more familiar with a few of the machines. It was so informative, it was awesome. We love you, Alba, hopefully you're watching. Um, it was great, it was great, it was great. Every one of us had said that, it, it really was. Um, we feel a lot more comfortable with, especially the multi-needle, um, we wanted to get more comfortable with it. So she succeeded. And then she did a customer one on the other day and that was full and the customers loved it. Um, there were there were a few people in that and again they raved about it she, alba has just a, a great way of presenting the information that it makes sense it makes complete sense when she talks to you about it so so that was awesome um again thanks to alba for coming in this week um we all us the employees and the customers totally enjoyed your stay with us so again, let's, oh, and we remember, we're open seven days a week now. So we're open on Sundays. This Sunday, Carol is back from her traveling excursions, and she'll be here, but just nine to one um, on Sunday. So if you want to come in and say hello, Carol will be here. And again, don't forget, our Mac Valley Quilt Show, September 30th, October 1st, nine to four at... Hope Community Church and Newburyport. So you can look that up on Merrimack Valley Quilt Guild website. There's all kinds of information out there on that. Okay, I think that's it. Our product of the week is Floriani. So you wanna stock up on your stabilizers, come on in, scissors, clips, Floriani's all on sale. And the fabric of the week is any Kaufman. So, and we have quite a bit of Kaufman. So, any of that, come on in. That's our sale for the week. I hope you all have a marvelous weekend. I'm off for the weekend, so I'm off for like three days in a row. I'll be sewing some of the time. I know I have a few projects still, um, fall projects that I'm trying to tie up so I can bring them in and show you. Um, the crow was one. I had already done the cats. It's a fall star one and something else so i'll be making them in you'll be on the lookout for that next week so have a wonderful weekend folks